Is life already written or do we create our own destiny? Guys, this question has been evolving around the YouTube channel for a long time now, so I thought I'd answer this once and for all. Um, I've reached out to a lot of masters over the past few years, asking questions about destiny, asking questions about the purpose in life. And throughout the journey, what I came to realize is that two of these things are happening at the same time. And that's why yesterday we actually got a question, um, and I just read it just literally now, um, it's 1, what is this, 12.50 a.m. right now, pre-event, um, and I just thought, what video shall I put up for tomorrow? And I was checking through the video yesterday. By the way, thanks for all the support for the um, action movie video that I created. Um, and I got, the last question was from Paige and asking about astrology. And a lot of people look into astrology and think it to be true. And if astrology is true, then what's this whole thing about creating our destiny? How can we use law of attraction and manifest things if everything is already set out and destiny is already there? But what if I could get you to actually understand that the two of these things are actually happening at the same time? Meaning what? Meaning your destiny? Yes, it's set. But at the same time, you can create. Now, you're probably getting a bit confused here, so I'm going to draw it out for you. But before we get into it, show reel. Hit it! What's up guys, it's Erico here, international speaker, entrepreneur, and best-selling author. And in this video, I'm going to break down for you, once and for all, whether we create our destiny or destiny is already mapped out and already planned out for us. So if you follow me over here, I'm gonna take you over to my beautiful, beautiful drawing. By the way, if you guys, I just wanna say, some people when they look at my drawing, they never know what I'm drawing. But I did actually go to art college. Um, so if you don't understand what my drawing is, it's probably be because you are not at my level yet, okay? So, um, first off, okay, let's put us here, okay? So, you get an understanding of this. So, this is where we are right now. And this is our so-called destiny, what um, astrology uh, or um, can, can talk about and the alignment. Or some people can refer to the Bible and say, you know, God's already mapped out our purpose and our destiny. So, that will be this destiny what we are all going towards. Now, at the same time, why is it that we can create? Is because this destiny is mapped out for us. The destiny is mapped out based on, okay? Now, this, understand this first of all, and, I'll, and then throughout the video, you'll probably get a better understanding of it. So, this is our intuition, okay? Intuition, by the way, when I say this, is that thing that science cannot explain. So logic mind, they talk about, okay, it comes from the brain or it comes from programming or past programming. But intuition is a feeling. And if you ask, where does intuition come from? I asked this at the event um, a few days ago uh, out in Slovakia. And some people said, okay, intuition comes from the gut. Some people said intuition comes from the heart. Some, some people say intuition comes from the divine. So it doesn't matter what you label it, let's not go there right now, but understand this intuition or this good feeling, or I sometimes like to say God feeling, or some people call gut feeling, okay? So that feeling, when you feel that desire, um, and you probably had this situation before, sometimes you can be, I don't know, sitting at a bus stop. And then what happens is next, next to you, you see this lady, You've never met her before, it's a total stranger, but for some reason, now they don't have to be like really good looking or anything, but you have this feeling, this intuition, this almost like calling, like you just want to speak to her and you don't know why. And you just want to say hi, you just want to smile. And when you do and when you start the conversation, what you find is that you actually know this person um, in some way, shape or form. What does that mean? It means there's certain things that connect 
right? And you probably had that situation before. Why does that happen? It's because everything has already been mapped out. That was supposed to be there. That has already existed in a parallel universe. Now, some of you will get a little bit confused in terms of parallel universe. So I'm just going to draw it out so you get a better understanding of this. So let's say, for example, okay, we walk down our path, right? Our path towards our good feeling, our God feeling, our good feeling, our intuition. Then what will happen is our logical mind, which is, by the way, not so logic. So I'm just going to write here, okay? Logic. So sometimes our logical mind is not so logic. And why I say that is because our logic comes from other people telling us what's right, what's wrong, what, what, um, what can happen, what can't happen. And that builds our logic. So our logic only comes from our surroundings and the people who have taught us. So it's not so logical, really. And what happens is our logic kicks in and it takes us a different route. We say, oh, I don't think that um, it's practical going down this route because I'm supposed to get a job. Why am I thinking to start my own business? You know, so you go down this route into these different jobs and these different jobs. And then you go down this route and then this route. And then what happens is you always have this intuition, by the way, intuition, gut feeling, God feeling is a straight line. This is what I've come to realize. That's why a lot of people, they, today they ask me, they say, Eric, how is it that you seem to just like flow every single day? You seem to just like not need to worry about things, not need to stress about things, but everything just seems to pan out for you and everything kind of comes your way. It's, it's like you're really lucky or something. And I always say that if you allow yourself, if you're daring enough to actually trust that of the divine, trust that of the universe, trust in God, something that is actually greater than us. Now, some of you will be like, but I'm not spiritual. And some of you are like, but I, I don't believe in God. Now, it doesn't matter whether you believe in whatever you want to name it, but there's one thing you cannot deny. And that thing is, there was something that's so powerful it created you, me, and everything around us. And that power is greater than our capacity, our physical capacity. And nothing exists because it created us. And the two most defining moments when we are brought into this world and when we are taken away, this greater power has the decision, has the power, has the control to be able to put you in this planet and take you away whenever he, she, it wants. Now, if this thing exists, then there's nothing to really not trust in and if we understand that, hey, this thing called intuition, good, good feeling, God feeling, whatever you want to call it, it exists. If you dare to suspend and stop thinking logically and then just trust in everything that comes your way and keep taking that step forward, even though some steps are the unknown. And this is why people's logic mind kicks in, by the way, because our minds are there to protect us. And whenever our mind is always there to protect us, it always says, be careful of this, be careful of that. Our mind is not there to make us really rich or to make us free. And so what our mind does is our mind keeps trying to protect us and keep us safe while not allowing us to actually step into the unknown. Now think about it for a second. The place you want to go to, right? The steps that you need to take, there are going to be a lot of risks you need to take. There are going to be steps you need to take. There are going to be people you don't know that you need to speak to. And that's that feeling. And if you dare to step into that power of intuition, gut feeling, God feeling, then you go onto this path. Now, why is it that we talk about, okay, we can create our destiny? Because while we're going along these routes, we can create any route we want to create. For example, in the past, when I first started in business, I said, I want to um, build a successful restaurant chain. And the reason behind it is because my logic mind, which was programmed by my father, said, Eric, you've got no qualifications. What are you going to do apart from work in restaurants all your life? So naturally, my logical mind said, hey, do all of this. Then what happens is, finally, Right. And I'm fortunate because I was only doing this for maybe, I don't know, seven to 10 years. And then finally, I found this path of intuition, good feeling and God feeling that took me and is taking me every single day towards my purpose and my destiny. And then you become more awakened when you go along this journey. If you actually want to know a little bit more about this, because um, 
there's actually different parallel universes that is happening all at the same time. So it means that every, everything can take us along a different type of path to take us to a different reality, but there's multiple destinies at the same time. If you actually want to know a little bit more about parallel universes, just drop a comment below with parallel universe, and maybe I'll create a separate video for you. But I hope this has allowed you to broaden your mind a little bit for you to be able to understand the possibilities and what's actually happening. This is why you can create all the realities and this is why all the realities exist at the same time. Guys, if you've enjoyed this video, please do hit the like button. Also, comment below. Let us know where you guys have tuned in from. We got this event here in London this weekend. By the way, if you're in and around the UK and you want some tickets, just drop a message below and I'll get my team to drop you some information about tickets. And also, if you're new to this channel, remember, remember, if you're not already, hit that subscribe button and the notifications button next to it because now I'm dedicated to making daily videos even when it is. 1 a.m. in the morning, pre-event. I'm going to be on stage tomorrow morning. Even when it's this, I'm dedicated to keeping you accountable with positivity, business strategies, spirituality, anything fun, positive, to keep you inspired and keep you aligned to make 2018 your best year yet. But for now, guys, <laughs> ciao.